This is your Royal Fidelity Business News. Thanks for tuning in. Well, the busy Thanksgiving travel holiday is just days away. This means that the country's major economic engine will get a boost. In light of this, stakeholders at the country's main port of entry say they're prepared as 90,000 passengers are expected to pass through the Linden Pendling International Airport. The busy season kicks off this week and should run through December 2nd. Well, the Central Bank of the Bahamas has facilitated a $10 million initial public offering of local registered stocks. The offering, which closed on November 13, 2019, was fully subscribed. Bank officials say the refunds were processed for the value date of November 21st for customers who received partial allocations. Successful participants are able to collect their stock certificates 30 days following the settlement of the offering December 15, 2019. And the world's biggest luxury goods company is buying U.S.-based jeweler Tiffany & Company for more than $16 billion. The largest luxury goods deal to date gives Louis Vuitton billionaire owner a bigger slice of one of the fastest growing upmarket sectors. He said Tiffany had an unparalleled heritage and fitted with his other brands. Tiffany has been hit by lower spending by tourists and a strong U.S. dollar. This has been your Royal Fidelity Business Report. Good evening.